Hello everybody and welcome to Just Football as I'm bringing you the latest transfer news from Kids Chiefs. Now Kids Chiefs have opened talks with Tabo Tele. Now if you're new on Just Football, kindly click on the subscribe button as we upload similar content every week. Now let's get on with the video. Now this is coming in from the SABC spot. They are saying Kids Chiefs are understood to have reignited their talks with midfielder Tabo Tele and enticed him with a new offer. Now SABC Sport can reveal that the Soweto Club's interest in Tabo Tele is nothing new and goes as far back as 2021 when Stuart Baxter was still Amakosi head coach. But a possible move fell through at the time as the player decided to join Radomiak Redom. Now according to information gathered by SABC Sport, uh, Tele will become a free agent from 1 August 2023 following a decision by Radomir Kredom not to extend his contract further while also having already signed a replacement. Now it is believed that case ships have tabled a three-year deal with uh, with expectations that the teller will put pen to paper if all the final details are ironed out in the coming days. Now, during the Kosovo Cup, Tele uh, told SABC Sport that he was open to moving back home and was well aware of the interest and speculations around his future. Now, this is great, great news for Kizu Chiefs. I did make a video earlier on where I was telling you that Kizu Chiefs have Tabo Tele in their list as a, a possible option in their central defensive midfield role. Now, Tabo Tele to Kizu Chiefs, three offer offered to Tabo Tele. Now, this can only be official. Uh, next week because Tabo Tele is not a free agent yet so Kiz Chiefs are trying to negotiate fast before he officially becomes a free agent because we know the player is also in the list for Mamelodi Sundowns and also other teams also in Europe but at the moment it looks like uh, Tabo Tele is also ready to come back home now Kiz Chiefs may yet get Tabo Tele in this transfer window we know there's been a lot of disappointment at Kiz Chiefs but Tabo Tele is a big possibility we know they're also are trying to sign Spongsenim Tetua from uh, Stellenbosch FC. I'm not sure if Kiz Chiefs are going to be walking away from that deal, but I, I told you earlier, it's not going to be simple to sign Spongsenim Tetua from Stellenbosch FC unless there are some players included in that deal, someone like uh, Hawale Schota, because Stellenbosch FC are very much interested in that player. But at the moment, the Tabo Tele to Kiz Chiefs is a great possibility. Three-year deal has been offered to the player, and so uh, the wages are also said to be huge because he's going to be coming in on a free transfer now give me your thoughts on the situation of Tabak do you think Tabak will end up at KDC because at the moment we're expecting that Mamelo Sanas will also try and pounce on this situation because they also have Tabo Tele in their list and also at uh, Mamelo Sanas you know currently they are targeting local players because of what is happening with uh, the foreign quarter rules but let's wait and see in the coming few days tell me what you think about Tabak do you think it's going to end up at KDC or Mamelo Sanas at the moment KDC are in front of the queue because they have opened talks with the player and his agent now also, if you're new on Just Football, kindly click on the subscribe button as we upload similar content every week. And also click a like on the video if you liked this update.